withholding has been defined by the supreme court by the constitution bench withholding means the bill falls through the bill is dead decent language used for instead of using rejected so when you say withhold withhold means the bill is dead what is the institution of governor governor is a constitutional institution and our constitution has created the position of governor and defined the roles and responsibilities of governor and among the roles and responsibilities of the governor in the constitution if you read the articles are very clear there are several articles first and foremost responsibility of the governor is to protect the constitution of india because whether it is a union or the state each of these entities have to work according to the constitution that is the sacred document we have and to protect it how how does governor protect not by putting a book of constitution putting in the log vault it is safe now <laughs> you protect a constitution and protect the constitution when suppose a state legislature you know in our constitution defines also the separation of power this is the power of the state this is the power it is we have our seven schedule where you have a union list you have a state list and you have concurrent list so whatever is in the state list a state makes whatever union union list and whatever in the concurrent if the union has not made any law a state can make the law number 1 number 2 if the union has made a law already even then a state can make a law but that but that law must be compatible with the union law act parliament law this is what it is now suppose a state makes a law which is very transgresses after all what is the in the legislature a political party has a brute majority let us say they can pass any law they can pass any bill that will not be law that will be bill the bill will be passed now if it transgresses the constitutional limit the bill passed by the legislature by the assembly does not become a law until governor assents to it now this assenting to is a constitutional responsibility that the governor has to see whether this bill is exceeding the limit it's whether the state is exceeding its competence if it exceeds the competence then it is the responsibility of the governor to not to assent the bill and what is the constitution says constitution says that a bill passed by the legislature first of all we should also realize not the word legislature assembly because legislature of a state is defined in the constitution legislature of a state consists of number 1 governor governor number 2 legislative assembly and wherever there is legislative council the legislative council so governor is a part of the legislature so a bill passed by the assembly does not mean it is passed by the legislature because the assembly is a part of the legislature so when the bill is passed and is sent to the governor governor he or she exercises his or her respons constitutional responsibility of being a constituent of the legislature by taking into account whether this bill is this going beyond the competence and that is why in article 200 of the constitution it says 
that when a bill passed by the assembly is given for forwarded to the governor for assent governor has three options one assent give assent problem is no there is no problem second withhold the assent and you know what is withholding means withholding doesn't mean that i am just holding it withholding has been defined by the supreme court by the constitution bench withholding means the bill falls through the bill is dead it is a decent language used for instead of using rejected that that becomes too crude so when you say withhold withhold means the bill is dead or third he reserves the bill for the president but governor reserves the bill for the president ideally there is a discretion of the governor in some cases if he does not give assent it is beyond him suppose in a concurrent list if a subject of the concurrent list a state assembly has passed a bill now governor cannot give assent on that because parliament has passed a law so it has to go to the president so governor reserves it and sends it to the president for the president consideration to assent or not to assent and there again the president has the same option withhold the assent or gives the assent governor can only reserve it.